Frugal living is a lifestyle that emphasizes simplicity and saving money. It involves finding ways to live a comfortable and fulfilling life while minimizing expenses and avoiding unnecessary spending. This can involve making budgeting a priority, finding ways to save on everyday expenses, and looking for ways to reduce one's impact on the environment. Some people adopt a frugal lifestyle to save money for future goals, such as retirement or paying off debt, while others may be motivated by environmental or ethical concerns. We help teach people about money, personal finance, and investments. If you're interested in improving your financial future, make sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the like button if this video is helpful. In this video, we're going to watch Dave Ramsey Top 12 Frugal Living Ideas for 2023. Live on a cash-only basis. The cash-only lifestyle may not be for everyone, but it can be a great way to save money and live a more simple life. Use of credit and debit cards can make you spend more than you can afford. When you only use cash, you are more mindful of your spending and are less likely to make impulse purchases. Additionally, you'll never have to worry about paying interest on your credit cards or being charged late fees. If you're looking to save money, the cash-only lifestyle may be worth considering. Make a budget and stick to it. Making and sticking to a budget can be difficult, but it's important to do if you want to stay on top of your finances. A budget can help you track your spending, keep track of your income, and make sure you're not spending more than you're bringing in. Live below your means. One important key to financial success is to live below your means. This means spending less money than you earn and saving the rest. It sounds simple, but it can be hard to do in practice. There are many temptations to spend money, and it can be difficult to resist them. But if you can stick to a budget and save money regularly, you will be on your way to financial security. Invest in only what you need. There's no need to break the bank in order to invest in your future. You can start small and invest only what you need in order to reach your goals. Over time, you can increase your investment and grow your portfolio. Investing is a great way to secure your financial future. And by starting small, you can make it a part of your overall financial strategy. There's no need to go all in from the start. You can gradually increase your investment over time. Use coupons. If you're looking to save money on your grocery bill, one of the best things you can do is use coupons. There are a variety of ways to get coupons, including clipping them from newspapers and magazines, printing them from websites, and receiving them from manufacturers. Using coupons can help you save a significant amount of money on your grocery bill, so it's definitely worth taking the time to find and use them. Repair instead of replacing. Have you ever heard the phrase, if it ain't broke, don't fix it? While this is sometimes true, there are also many instances where it is better to repair something instead of replacing it. For example, if you have a hole in your clothing, it is usually better to sew it up than to throw it away and buy a new piece of clothing. Shop at thrift stores. Shopping at thrift stores can be a great way to save money while still getting the items you need. Because thrift stores generally sell items at a discount, you can often find what you're looking for at a fraction of the cost of buying it new. Additionally, thrift stores typically have a wide variety of items, so you're likely to find what you're looking for, even if you're not sure what you need. Trade services with friends. There's nothing like a good trade to make things more interesting. If you've got a commodity that your friend needs, and they've got something you need. It's the perfect way to get what you want without having to spend any money. Win-win. Of course, not every trade is going to be fair. That's where negotiation skills come in handy. If you're able to haggle and come to an agreement, then you can make sure that both parties are happy with the deal. Get rid of unnecessary expenses. If you wanted to save money, you need to get rid of unnecessary expenses. You don't need to spend money on things that you don't need. You can save money by getting rid of your cable TV subscription, eating out less, and driving less. You don't need to spend money on things that you don't need or want. You can save money by making small changes in your spending habits. Travel inexpensively. When traveling on a budget, there are a few things you can do to keep your costs down. 
One of the best ways to do this is to plan your trip in advance and be flexible with your travel dates. This will allow you to take advantage of lower airfare rates. Another way to cut costs is to look for alternate modes of transportation, such as taking the bus or train instead of flying. Additionally, try to book accommodation and location that are not in the heart of the city, as these tend to be more expensive. By following these tips, you can save a lot of money on your next trip. Live simply. We all know that life can be pretty complicated sometimes. One way to do it is to live more simply. This doesn't mean giving up all your possessions and moving to a remote cabin in the woods, but it does mean decluttering your life and getting rid of anything that isn't absolutely essential. Living simply can help you to focus on what's really important in life and to enjoy the moment more. It can also help to reduce stress as you won't be juggling as many. Spend less than you earn. If you want to be financially successful, it's important to spend less than you earn. That may sound like common sense, but it's surprising how many people end up in debt because they spend more than they make. Thanks for watching today's video. Let us know in the comments how you liked it. If you're interested in seeing more videos like this, please subscribe. We love getting feedback from our viewers, so please let us know what you thought. Stay tuned for more videos.